Friday, 9th of August, 2019. Remember, if you remember, we had made a colony here and what we did was we put in a separating board or a division board inside here. Let's go in and see what is the result. Right away I can see that all the propolis that these bees bringing in here to insulate the colony is really, really nice. It's very sticky because we have a, a very hot day today. All right, so let's go in here now and see what is the result of putting in this piece of board. Because this board, because this colony is a bit weak, we put in this separator board here to reduce the space that the bees will occupy. All right, because we don't want them to be forced into keeping this whole area at 96 degrees. So we put that separator board and we reduce the amount of bees. Uh, we reduce the, the space now. And right away I can see, because remember the colony we went in just now, it had honey in it, sealed honey. They started to seal some honey in August by 2019, you know. Yeah. Look at that, we have, we have nectar sauce in here. We have a lot of nectar in here. On both sides, we have a lot of nectar. You can see it glittering in the sunlight there. And that means that this colony is, although they, 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 that, they was that weak, they work in. So, reducing the, the amount of space that the bees will occupy, you see? You see how the, the propolis, it's so thin there, it's separating there like lagly, like glue. Yeah, so. Let's take up this frame here and see. Oh my! These bees, they're working nice, man. They're building out. They're building the frame. Look at that. So if I feed them, they'll be able to continue building this frame. Yeah, on this side too. So what we'll do, we'll flip it around to further encourage them to build out this frame. Yes, man. And what I notice here now is that the adjacent frame here have a nice brood pattern on it. Let's see if they will allow us to examine this. I notice they they they're very um alert you know. Alright. Let's take up this one here. Let's look at the brood pattern. Let's see what this queen is doing. Oh my gosh. This queen is getting ready to create a boom here, boy. It have that, that laying pattern is fantastic. You see, look at her laying pattern here. She have a lot of eggs. Yes, man. She, she started up a little slow, a little weak, because I didn't have enough brood to put but now, she, with that little help that I gave her, she's doing well. So, let's put them back here gently. And uh, I will feed them. And they will even do better. Alright. Let's have one or two bees that check them out, you know. So, before... I get sting and start a whole frenzy here. Let's put them back gently. Come, don't get squeezed. Move from there. Move, move, move. Yes, man. So, this is a good sign to see, to show you how when you put a, reduce the space, the bees are better able to handle the situation. Alright, so what we will do is we wouldn't put we wouldn't put um we wouldn't put a super a feeder super on top here. What we will do is we'll put the feeder inside here. Alright. So we'll leave this box as it is. Alright. That's my girls. Right. 
Where is the in a top cover? Right. Put on the top cover back here. That is how it's done, man. In the 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 B man of Trinidad B yard. Right. So put them put these blocks on top here too. So the top cover wouldn't fly off. All my hand gets fingers get stick up with propolis now. So folks, fun fun fun. Come and have some fun with me man. Yeah you're welcome. That's why I keep saying have fun, have fun. Alright so we're going to put the feed supers on all the other boxes and another day we'll come back and prepare the feed and put it on. So stay tuned, thanks for watching, don't forget, I'm looking out for that thumbs up, like and share, ring that bell icon, tell a friend, subscribe, if you do all those goodies, I will continue to send you goodies, goodies like that, let's take a look at these fellas, these gills over here, sometimes it does always say fellas, you know, but it's not fellas, it's all of them is gills. The fellas and them just be around, you know, but at this time of the day, them going and liming on a branch waiting to see if they could see a queen they have to mate with. So, folks, again, thanks for watching. Thanks for keeping me company. TTFN. Bye for now. Catch you in the next one.